Hello, my friends. Welcome to all my new and returning subscribers to my Southern Kitchen and to the 293rd episode here on Ellen's Homemade Delights. I'm Ellen. Hope all you're doing well. Today's recipe, I'm going to show you how to make some homemade biscuits. But this isn't your ordinary biscuits. We're going to make blueberry biscuits. That's right, sugar. Blueberry biscuits. And my friends, this is the bomb.com. It is so delicious, full of blueberry goodness, and as always, it is so simple and easy to make. And if you don't feel like having regular biscuits for your breakfast, please try these blueberry biscuits. Everybody will fall in love with this recipe. And I'll post a complete recipe along with the instructions down below in the description box. And also check out my biscuits playlist for more biscuit recipes. So roll up your sleeves, pull on your apron, grab your flour and your blueberry sugar, because we're about to bake some blueberry biscuit magic in my southern kitchen. Here we go. All right, my friends, in my large bowl, I have two cups of stuffed rice and flour. And we're going to add in a fourth of a teaspoon of ground nutmeg, a half a teaspoon of baking soda, and two tablespoons of white sugar. Going to give that a quick whisk until it's nice and well combined. All right, now it's time to add in our fats. I'm using four tablespoons, which is a half a stick of unsalted butter that I grated. It's nice and cold. Very important when you're making biscuits or scones, make sure all your fats and your liquids is cold. And a half a cup of cold cube butter flavor shortening. And using my pastry cutter, or you can use a fork, we're just going to cut the butter and shorten it until it reaches coarse crumbs. All right, my friend, this is what the flour looks like. Nice coarse crumbs. All right, that looks great. Next, we're going to add in the zest of a large lemon, one cup of cold buttermilk, and I have a recipe on making homemade buttermilk and stuffed rice and flour. I'll post a link to that down below in the description box. Last but not least, the star. We're going to add in one cup of fresh blueberries I wash, or you can use frozen, and we're going to stir all them together until it's nice and well combined. Be careful not to bust the blueberries. Mmm, smells good. Love the smell of lemon. Lemon and blueberries are one of my favorite combinations. All right, my friends, I'm through mixing up everything and I placed my dough on the flour surface. So now we're just going to knead it a few times, like so. All right, my friends, I'm through rolling and kneading the dough. So now we're going to flatten a little bit. We're going to create some layers. Going to fold it and flatten it and fold it again and flatten it. And using the glass, or you can use a biscuit, a biscuit cutter, we're just going to cut it just like that. You don't want to twist it. Just like that. All right, I'm going to go ahead and finish cutting the rest of my biscuits, and I'll bring you back. All right, my friends, I'm through cutting my biscuits, and I have seven. You can do any size that you prefer. So now I have some melted butter, which is going to brush the butter on top of the biscuits to give us a golden brown color. And I put it in the grease 9 inch cake pan, or you can use a cast iron skillet or a long baking pan. All right, so now we're ready to put these babies in the oven. We're going to put it in the preheated 450 degree oven, and we're going to let it bake for about 15 to 20 minutes. All right, I'll bring you back. 
All right, my friends, I'm through baking my blueberry biscuits, and it smells incredible up in this kitchen. Look at those blueberries. Alrighty. And while they're still hot, I have some more melted butter. I'm gonna brush them right on top. All right, my friends, there you have it. Southern blueberry biscuits. Don't they look good? And there's nothing like the smell of freshly baked biscuits straight out of the oven. You can smell it all over the house, too. All right, so now I'm about to pick me up a plate, and I'll give it a taste. All right, my friends, I picked me up a plate, and I put some more butter in it and some maple syrup, or you can put jelly or honey. All right, so now I'm going to close it up so the butter can melt. All right, now it's time for the best part, the tasting. Here we go. Ooh, look at that biscuit. Mmm. Ooh, so moist is just melting your mouth. The bottom's nice and golden brown. And the blueberries bite into it, just burst inside your mouth. These are incredible. They would be great for the kids that they're returning back to school. And also get you some grits and eggs and some sausage or bacon, and you'll be good to go. This is Dubbin' Mmm, mmm. Look how nice and soft these are. Blueberry biscuit licious. My friends, many thanks so much for watching and joining me in my southern kitchen today. If you enjoyed this video and this recipe, please give it a thumbs up. I do appreciate it. Don't forget to share this with your family and friends. Like, comment, and subscribe to my channel. And click on the bell so that way you'll be notified when my new videos come out. And I'll see y'all on my next video. Let's eat.